Hey everybody, it's Matt here out in the woods and just wanted to take you guys with me on a hike today. I'll show you a couple cool things out here. This is going to be an exploring channel, so you're going to see me out here going to different places, taking you guys with me. Figured might as well film it and share it with everybody since I do this anyway, just for fun. This is a nice spot right here. We're on the ledge overlooking a swamp. So I like coming out, looking at the woods in the winter time because you can really see everything that you can't see in the spring when there's all this uh, tree cover and whatnot. All the plants have leaves on them. So I just want to say that exploring is a passion of mine. Um, I like coming out here, just looking around, getting some exercise and just discovering things because you never know what you're going to find. Got another old stone wall right here. Uh, it's hard to say exactly who constructed these monuments. Some people say it's the Native Americans. Some people say it's the farmers that used to work and live around here. But the sure as hell don't make them like this anymore. like 30 degrees out here today so my hands are absolutely freezing right now I'm taking you guys to an ancient megalith now these megalith structures are Native American in origin Here. I found a, some milky quartz sticking out of the ground. It's a sign we're in the right place. I like to stay a little bit off the beaten path. Oh, this is a really nice view right here. I believe we're coming up on the spot right now. It's gonna be exploring all sorts of different things on this channel, ranging from Native American sites like the one I'm gonna show you right now, uh, old abandoned things I found out in the woods, just all sorts of cool stuff I wanna share. So right now we're on top of the hill, but if you look down, it's an ancient work site. And right now we're looking down. It goes down about 30 feet. It's the site I'm talking about here. As you can see, the stacked stones. And just compared to the rest of the land around here at this park, there's nothing quite like it. Get a closer view for you guys. Here we are. And we got this old stone wall leading up to the site. But we'll get up. I'll show you guys a closer look here. I think we might hit one more site today. This one was placed here long ago. It must weigh a couple tons. It's about the size of a car. That wall comes up all the way from down there, goes through this site, and then it continues down there.
I'll take you guys down there another day. I'm gonna take you guys to see one more thing today while I'm out here. Wish I could go to a couple more spots when it's getting really cold. I think I'm gonna have to bring some better gloves with me next time because it's freezing. Coming up on an old crossing right now. The stream goes down a ways. Here are all sorts of animals and stuff out here. This is another megalith I wanted to show you guys. A really interesting point to it. Now I'm not sure if it was a tool they might have used to sharpen their weapons. It's really impossible to say. There's the tip right there. If you look back, you can see it has some layers to it. It's a very interesting rock nonetheless. I've seen pictures of rocks with similar points to them. That's how I recognize it as a megalith. All right, so I think this is a good place to end the video. Uh, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate it. Like and subscribe. Thanks again for watching.